chiquitos y chiquitas. Um, I don't think chiquitos is a real word, but just go with it. I'm here with my June favorites. First, I have the Clinique Even Better Foundation, and I'm in the shade Linen, which is actually the lightest shade, and I have a funny story about when I went to get this. So, I was in Sephora, and I was looking at a bunch of different foundations, and I came across the Clinique Even Better line, and I was trying to figure out what shade I was, and um, a guy came up to help me who worked at Sephora, and he was like, oh, you're definitely the lightest shade, and then I proceeded to turn bright red because I was like, I should have known. I am the color of printer paper. So I was turning bright red and he was trying to color match me and he was like, you're turning really red right now. And I was just like, oh gosh. And I started turning even more red. I had to wait like two minutes for my face to go back to normal. Anyways, that's my story. I really like this foundation. It doesn't clog your pores. Kind of like a medium coverage, very lightweight feeling on your face and sometimes I'll do two layers if I'm going out at night and I want like extra coverage. When I was at Sephora they had a little sale section and I picked up this eyeliner. It's called Smoky Coal and it's in the shade Made in Italy. Haha. <laughs> I don't know but it's blue <laughs> or navy. It's so pretty. It looks kind of gray. Wait there you can see it. It's kind of like a navy blue and I've been loving using this. Kind of smudge it on my lower lash line if I want. Just a little pop of color. And then I have, this is like so been worn and torn, you can't even read it, but I don't even know what brand it is because it's all worn off. But it's a taupe eyebrow pencil. Sorry that the name is totally gone. This is what it looks like. I've been trying to find the perfect shade for my eyebrows because I have such a weird eyebrow color. It's like not brown, it's not blonde, it's not, I don't know. My instructor at my makeup school, she was like, why don't you try a taupe eyebrow pencil? So I went to Walgreens and I picked this up and it matches perfectly. I love it. So if you have kind of like an odd in-between eyebrow color, I highly recommend checking this one out. If you can find it at Wal Walgreens, Walmart, or just any taupe pencil. Next is an eyeshadow and this is MAC Soft Brown and it looks like this. It's just a perfect crease blending color, like a transition color from your eyelid to your brow bone. This is perfect for that, and I love using that with a crease brush like my MAC 217. Next, I think this has been featured in like a billion videos, but the Maybelline Dream Bouncy Blush in Peach Satin, and it's kind of destroyed and squished, but it's a squishy blush and it's like the perfect peachy coral color and I like to use it with a stipple brush and I just go like that and then I swirl it on and then last but not least two Revlon lip butters this one is in peach parfait looks like this pretty pretty I love these because they're super moisturizing and they are pigmented at the same time this one is berry smoothie which is that guy right there. And for just a random favorite, I'll pick a song. And currently, my favorite song is Good Time by Owl City featuring Carly Rae Jepsen. Jepsen. And I just love that song. If you guys have been following me for a long time, you know that Owl City is my absolutely favorite in the entire world. And I'm going to the Owl City concert. It's July 21st in San Francisco, and I'm really excited. I saw him last year, and he was amazing. Anyways, I love that song. It's just a really good summer song, upbeat, and I love it. I hope you guys enjoy. Peace out, Girl Scout.